simple spot that they began their journey in America. It was a journey that started a movement. I really was anticipating just like by the book history, but actually this is more of a living history because you're actually have the ability to walk through different properties, different times. I think learning the, the, the roots and how it evolved in, the, in this country is, is uh, fantastic and it's helping me direct and administer in my community. This is a, exists and it's a great tool for us as chaplains to sort of give the historical and spiritual background uh, behind what we do as our communities. Good night's sleep and uh, got some fuel this morning. We're, we're heading to Old uh, Otterbein Church right now, which is just on the other side of the Inner Harbor here. We were at the place where the very first Methodist class was formed in America, where the first Methodist convert was made in, in America, um, and the first Methodist passionate preaching occurred in America and we tie all of that into our mission vision and values uh, within the United Methodist communities I'm just really touched by the struggle that these people went through for their beliefs and and how they shared it with others It inspired me. I was like really in awe when I went to the various churches. I learned quite a lot, a lot more than I thought I knew. For me, what I'm doing now is just a continuation of the ministry that they started. We hope that all the people that we bring on this trip will take away a greater appreciation of our mission, our vision, and our values, so that when they're in their communities, in the back of their minds, they know where our values come from, and they know why we're grounded as a service ministry in the Wesleyan tradition.